Hello everyone, welcome to my channel Adda for IT. My name is Kushbu and in this video we are going to discuss about one of the very very important topic in context of Hadoop that is something called as its history. So in this video we will be looking out how Hadoop got evolved. We will be studying about its history in the form of a story. So let us start. As you can see on the screen that there is some years written that is starting from 2002 and ending till 2009. So this is the year in which Hadoop got evolved. So let's start from the first year that is 2002. Actually in the year 2002 there was two person called as Dog Cutting and the other person name was my Caffarella. So this was the two person and they actually started a project called as Apache Nudge Project. Apache Nudge project which could crawl and index millions of web pages but actually when they thought of its expense the expense was not affordable it was actually costing five hundred thousand dollar which was very expensive for them to offer at that point of time now in 2003 google released a paper called as gfs that is a search paper. So this GFS stands for Google File System. So in this search paper that is GFS, Google actually detailed about the architecture of this GFS and offered a solution for storing a huge data set, huge amount of data set in a distributed kind of manner. So this search paper actually proved to be a half solution for their Apache Nudge project whose project that was that was of dog cutting and my Gavrela's project. So the problem that we're facing that was of expense, so it got solved because they got the idea of storing the large amount of data set while web crawling or web indexing. So this proved to be as a half solution, all right? Now, moving in the year 2004, Google released one another paper or article you can see named as Map Radius. So in this map reduce, they actually describe of processing the huge amount of data set in the distributed fashion. So this actually proved to be an another half solution for their this project that is Apache Nudge project, which proved to be as a another half solution. So what Dog Cutting and Mike Caffrella does is that they combine this Google's search papers together and started using in their Apache Nudge project as an open source. Now in 2005, Cutting felt that this project that is Apache Nudge project was only limited to 20 to 40 clusters. 20 to 40. For, uh, 40 cluster which was again a limitation for their project so to overcome with their limitation more manpower was needed at that point of time because in their apache nudge project only two people were working who was that they were they were dog cutting and my caprella so only two people were there to get involved in this particular project but to overcome with this limitation which was only 20 to 40 cluster they need more manpower so at that time one company was there called as yahoo so this yahoo was quite interested to work in their project that was apache nudge project with their manpower so actually yahoo joined their apache nudge project with their uh, like employees at that point of time and started working on this apache nudge project now this was all about 2005 moving to the year 2006 now in 2006 dog cutting officially joined yahoo so this dog cutting one person officially joined this Yahoo company. Through his project, actually he wanted to provide an open source, scalable and reliable kind of 
framework to the word so what he did for this he separated the distributed part from this project that is apache natch project and formed an another project called as hadoop so in 2006 this hadoop came into existence how it came into existence because at that point of time Dow wanted to provide an open source a scalable and reliable kind of framework to the world so he named that project called as Hadoop actually this dog cutting was having a children and he was playing with a small elephant named Hadoop actually his son kept name of that small elephant that was a toy actually Hadoop that is why he thought of keeping that project name as Hadoop now this was all about 2006 moving in the year 2007 this Hadoop actually got tested on thousands of cluster thousands of cluster and they started using it as an open source now moving to the year 2008 in 2008 actually this yahoo presented this hadoop to the apache software foundation and this apache software foundation tested that hadoop on a 4000 nodes of cluster all right and finally after getting tested on this 4000 nodes of cluster in the year 2009 it was again tested to sort petabyte of data in less than 17 hours which could handle billions of searches and indexing millions of web pages so that's it about the history of hadoop i hope you understood its history in terms of a story so if you would have learned something from this video then please do like share and subscribe to my channel till then keep learning and stay tuned for getting the latest videos from this channel thank you so much